What's up guys, if you want cheap, fast, and reliable MT, and you want to get those spotlight challenges done, hit up my new sponsor DVDJ and use code YOURBOYBUGS for 10% off a checkout. And yeah man, check them out. What's good guys, if you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBAsafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. If you're looking to buy a stacked NBA 2K account with max badges and more, visit SportsTMB.com. He has been in the community for years and has hundreds of reviews. Click the first link in the description to get your account today. What's good YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video. And guys, today we're going to go over some market. We're going to go over pretty much what's going to happen if new content drops, what I have been noticing, and pretty much it's almost a guaranteed market crash at this point. Before we do get into the video, Please make sure you drop the sub, turn on the noti bells, like the video. Let's get this video to 100 likes. That would be greatly appreciated. Hopefully, we do see some new content dropping. And I'm going to prepare you guys for new content. So, pretty much, man, hopefully, I do work today. Um, hopefully, we do see some prime. Hopefully, we see anything that involves packs because I need. I got my MT now. I'm ready to roll. I got my MT up big time. And, oh, wait, What? I don't even know where this came from, but okay. Um, supposedly, I I, I don't know. But anyways, sorry for that. <laughs> right now, we are going to go over a ton of things. Um, there is a lot of things going on. I actually think that Rashard Lewis is a sniper -oo. Hopefully, we do get that snipe real quick. Oh, no, we missed it. Oh, I, did I get it? 34K quick? I think that's a snipe. Let's see if we can get a snipe for the video starting off. We see 47k, 46k, 45, 46, 45, 45. All right. Well, we just got a snipe to start off the video. He is 44k. We are going to make some MT real quick. We got him for 34. So, W's in the chat. Right now, guys, we are going to go over ways to make MT. And also, before I get into this, if you do not have MT and you have a God Squad, whatever you have, if you have some ways to get your MT to at least 100k, that would be very helpful before we do get into the video. Like, you need to make sure you have a certain amount of MT to make MT. That's number one. At least 50k. 50k is fine. Because if packs do drop, you need to have MT to snipe. And I'm going to show you some methods of mine that I like to do when content does drop. This will make you thousands, millions of MT if you just take the time and patiently snipe. So, without further ado, let's get into my methods. And right now, bro, I noticed one thing. When they drop new content, the most money and the most consistent snipe filter by far is this one right here, bro. Maximum buyout, 600. Oh, there we go. Right there. Missed it, of course. Maximum buyout, 600. Um, it's so money. It doesn't even matter. Right now, since 2K is that hot, this filter is actually so money. Like, I seriously do recommend you guys do try it. Um, first off, this, this method could be deadly with 10K MT. So if you have 10k MT, I would 110% work on this filter. When new content drops, sometimes kids throw up the new cards for really, really cheap. And also another thing, I'm not going to buy that. Another thing that I noticed when new content drops is that you could get on the snipe filter. So since they did just drop the new buzzer beater, I would head over to buzzer beater pink diamond, put my thing to like 30k and just keep refreshing. If I get a Chris Weber or a Drazen, that's auto profit. Pretty much anything that drops, you want to take advantage. So whatever content they drop, you want to get on that snipe filter ASAP. If they drop a new diamond, get on that snipe filter. I would say 30 minutes to 40 minutes later. Like diamonds are one of the most like intriguing cards you could look at. Any diamonds, new diamonds, new amethyst, even pink diamonds if you have more towards 100k MT. It's probably the best way to make MT. And also, like I said, man, try to get your MT up. If packs are coming... I wouldn't say sell your Opals. I wouldn't say sell your Tracys. I wouldn't say sell your Kevin Durant. I would not say that. I would just say try to sell some scraps in your collection. Make your MT and you could just buy them back. Like straight up. Right when content drops, you could pretty much do any snipe builder in the game and you'll make a minimum of 50k an hour. And I'm talking about minimum. As long as you stay on the auction. Like literally if you take an hour out of your day and stay on the auction for an hour when new content drops. Or pretty much any day at this point with the Opals dropping. You can make a ton of MT, and I really do recommend trying out this filter. Another filter that was insane, one of the best filters I've ever done 
in my history of 2k i made 30k on this filter in five minutes um i sniped out a rudy gobert i sniped out kds well i missed a kd i missed the ad if i would have got them i would have made over 50,000 mt but yo i'm with this filter 1950 i don't know what's good with this filter but cards fly like crazy when new content drops on this filter you guys need to do it like straight up for all you people that don't have a lot of mt for all you people that have like 20k mt it is like i mean you guys this is the best filter in the game, period. I don't know what, where these cards, like, all right. Um, it's literally insane. Also, if you have Larry Bird, I honestly kind of want to recommend you guys do sell him because his price did go up a lot. Prime cards, pretty much anything that is coming out, anything that drops will bring down the market. If you see any Opal, if you have a card that goes for like 70k, you have a ton of diamonds that go for like 50k, 30k, 20k, whatever, and you see on the auction block, or you hear an opal is coming out, please try to get rid of your cards. If you hear any opal come out, it's it's GG's, bro. You're going to lose thousands of MT. They will not rise again. It's pretty much just a reoccurring market crash every time an opal drops. Like the curry came out, market crashed, some pink diamonds did rise, but for the most part um it did crash and also another snipe filter to get your mt up is right here bro 4300 buyout whatever you want to do man whatever you think is fire and also like i said and when the market is crashed diamond bidding is straight money this is a method of mine that i don't know i haven't really heard a lot of youtubers talk about it i really haven't i kind of just figured it out on my own and if you notice like right now you see a ton of paul pierce is up so with that being said Usually, the other day I did it with Karl Malone, the other day I did it with Ben Simmons, and another day I did it with LeBron. Uh, when the market's flooded with cards, you could somehow land bids up for the really low. So let's let's just say Paul Pierce is like 30k. This is this bids up here for 20k, then you can go 22k. So if someone's gonna outbid you, you want to upstep them, bro. So now you want to put it to like 24.5. If they outbid you at the 22k and you bid on 24k, you're gonna get the card for 22k and like 100 MT. So this is another method preparing you guys to make a ton of MT. I really do recommend it. But honestly, my favorite filters are definitely, honestly, the best thing during the market crash, in my opinion, if you have some, if you have at least 100K MT, even 50K MT, is definitely diamond bidding. Diamond bidding is the fastest way to make MT. I made 50K off Car Malone in five minutes on my video. If you don't believe me, you can go check it out. Um, I got about 10... 9k car malones i sold them for 18k like 10 minutes later so what is that 18k 7k 7 times 10 70k made for some reason i don't know why there were so many bids up on the car malone and you just really got to pay attention to certain things you really got to pay attention to bidding because sometimes you really could make a lot of mtl bidding even if you don't realize it like it's actually that crazy but hopefully we do get some packs hopefully we do get some pro um some prime packs really expecting something to drop maybe a token market update because this is pre-recorded so whatever drops i don't know what happens if the trailer drops i have no idea hopefully we just got ah oh, we missed it yeah but this snipe filter is really good i saw a young simbo get dgj djj on it i saw a mr david thompson on it i've seen galaxy ovals miss on this snipe filter if you get any pink diamond or up even amethyst or up on this 500 filter you're gonna make a lot of mt and I really recommend you guys do it. But yo, like I said, get your MT up. I'm not saying sell your crazy cards. I would recommend selling some Amethyst, selling some Diamonds. Get your MT up. Let me know how it goes. Make sure to have your tokens ready as well. If you don't have tokens, I would suggest getting on Triple Threat Online ASAP. Getting that extra MT. And honestly, that's really all I got for the video. I hope you guys did enjoy. Please make sure to drop a sub. And yo... We're getting closer and closer to 6K. Please drop that sub. We're going to get another. We gained another 100 subs today. And without you guys, I don't know where I would be. Like straight up. I love you guys. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good one. Peace.